Hi guys, today on Divas Can Cook we are making melon ball punch. Isn't it pretty? It's like summertime in a glass and it's so easy to make, so let's go. So we're gonna start with three ripe melons. I have watermelon, cantaloupe, and honeydew. We're gonna slice right into that cantaloupe, right down the middle, and then scoop out all of those icky, slimy seeds. We don't need them. We're gonna do the same thing for the honeydew melon. Just get your little spoon and scrape it out. Slice into that watermelon and we are good to go. Aren't they beautiful? And it smells so good. They're really ripe, which is what you want for this recipe. Then go ahead and press that melon baller right into the flesh of the fruit. Give it a turn and you have these cute little adorable melon balls. This part was actually pretty fun. I really like doing this part. And try to use a seedless watermelon. It makes things so much easier when you don't have those seeds to deal with. All right, so here's our beautiful melon balls. Aren't they pretty? I just love the colors. All right, we're gonna place these onto a baking sheet lined with foil paper. We're gonna freeze these bad boys, okay? So put them in a single layer, and then pop them into the freezer until they are fully frozen. It doesn't take long. Now we're gonna prepare our punch mixture. I'm using some white grape juice, sparkling white grape juice, Sprite, and Simply Lemonade. I love that stuff. Go ahead and pour the white grape juice into the pitcher, followed by a little bit of Sprite, or any kind of lemon, lime flavor soda you wanna use. And then we're gonna add in the lemonade last. And I would have never thought to put this combination together with the white grape juice, the lemonade, and the Sprite. I'm just like, what? And if you taste it right now, you guys, you might be a little disappointed because I tasted it and I was like, no, I don't really like it. But the minute you add those melons in there, baby, mm, the melons take it to a whole new level. So once those bad boys are frozen, we're gonna go ahead and prep our limes, go ahead and slice them into little thin slices, and then go ahead and pick off some beautiful fresh mint leaves. And then we're gonna start putting this punch together. And here's what the magic really happens as far as the flavor is concerned in my opinion go ahead and add a ton of those melon balls to the pitcher add in some of those lemon slices I mean those lime slices and then we're gonna put in some fresh mint okay just like this right here we're gonna put the lid on and we're gonna refrigerate this for about 30 minutes let all of those flavors really come together and become one and reunite and procreate into this beautiful beautiful flavor it is so good you guys this would be great for like a wedding or brunch or baby shower it's gorgeous punch now I'm using the leftover frozen melon balls as ice cubes to keep the drink nice and cold and it looks so pretty go ahead and add some lime to garnish it and some fresh mint leaves and there you have it the mint really adds that nice cool touch to it the lime is so tart just everything is just beautiful I really like this punch and I think you guys are gonna love this one too you can find the recipe on my blog divasomecook.com with a ton of other recipes so go on over there and check it out thank you guys so much for watching later